I'm finally at the top of seniority list, so I can do whatever the hell I want, whenever I want to do it. <laughs> so that's dope, you know. Um, like literally, in the, like the top of that. So, but in, the, in all seriousness, it's fun, man. I just uh, I'm looking forward to just another role on this team, and that's uh, I've always talked about being a leader, but now it's the leader, you know. And um, you know, we got a younger group of guys coming in here. I got a refreshed mindset, and um, I'm just very excited to get things rolling. It's been a long off season, so the anxious has been setting in for a little bit. You know, it's finally here. Miles is our anchor. Um, he's going to protect the rim. He's going to do a lot for us. Um, so I'm just trying to come in and help him. Um, but, yeah, I'm going to be vocal uh, when I need to be, um, but also lead by example. <laughs> uh, yeah, we're going to miss JJ for sure. Um, it's, it's more of like, I say more off the court, you know. I mean, obviously we all know what JJ can do on the court, but just hold that, that presence he had in the locker room and just how much. He was pretty much like the the big brother to everybody, you know. Obviously he had the most years in the NBA. He had the most production in the NBA. It's just more like... He was that guy in the locker room that everybody could go to if they had a problem, if they needed advice on anything. Just more of that, that big brother aspect we're going to miss. Were you going to him more for stuff off the court than even on the court? I mean, I went to JJ for everything. I mean, I, I, that's because I respect JJ. I, I know what anything, everything that I went through, he went through it, or he went through it in some form. So I knew that he had to answer for everything. Are you content with your veterans that you had in terms of last year? You purposely brought in JJ. Um, you don't have the roster spot to do that this year. Are you good with this current bunch yeah i think some of what we'll lose with you know you know james not being here is going to have to be filled in by some of our younger players kind of finding their voice too you know at some point as you know our young guys take ownership of the team that involves being more vocal and you know that's a lot to ask a young player but i think some of our young players are growing into that role miles is a very vocal veteran who has the voice of the locker room has the attention of our players you know buddy tj mcconnell you know, Bruce Brown, you know, we have veterans that can fill that void, uh, but we also want to see some of our younger guys specifically, you know, I think Tyrese is, you know, getting ready to take on more of that vocal leadership. Um, his experience with USA basketball, I think, is giving a little boost of confidence too. So we'll see how that morphs out. We're going to miss James's presence, you know, is just his sheer presence, you know, brought a little personality to the locker room, but you know, each season is different, and I th I'd like to see some other guys, you know, step up into that leadership role.